Comcast customer says she got a bill addressed to Super Bitch by John Brodkin. Mary Bauer of Addison, Illinois, is like many people a frustrated Comcast customer. Her cable TV service continually kept shutting off, and she says 39 Comcast technicians visited her home over several months to try to fix the problem. Then, she stopped receiving her monthly bill. After four months without a bill, she called Comcast to ask how much she owed. A new bill was sent, but not to Mary Bauer. Instead, the bill was addressed to Superbitch Bauer, according to a report on WGN in Chicago yesterday. This is a disgrace to me, a disgrace, Bauer said. Why are they doing this to me when I pay my bills? Bauer never swore at Comcast employees or called them any disparaging names, she said. I was a little hot, I was angry at them because I never got good service, she said. After getting the super bitch bill, she was mad enough to call the local news station. I am not going to open this bill until they send me a new one with my name on it, she said. And I'm not going to be quiet about Comcast. I'm going to tell everyone not to get Comcast. Further reading, Comcast tells ours why it's not to blame in Netflix fight. It was only business. WGN quoted a Comcast spokesperson as saying that the company is investigating the matter thoroughly and that Comcast would reach out to Bauer. Comcast told ours today that it has reached out to Bauer but has no further information to share. Last week, we wrote about a Comcast customer whose first name was changed to asshole on a bill. Comcast apologized to the customer and offered a full refund for the previous two years and two years of service at no charge. Comcast also said it was looking into technology solutions to prevent such name changes and re-examining training of its customer service representatives. Comcast also reportedly fired a third-party call center that was involved in the asshole incident. Other Comcast customers have reported similar account name changes with insults such as whore and dummy. Comcast, the largest cable company in the U.S. with about 22 million customers, could soon be serving another 8 million subscribers if it is allowed to buy Time Warner Cable.